Hey guys, I'm Dr. Tembles and today I'll show you my new creation. It's a time-controlled light or time-controlled redstone signal. A red, a redstone signal. So, um, when sun set, you see here, um, I pushed the time a bit further, when sun is setting down at 6.30 p.m. Um, the lights at the bottom will glow and will make some light and um, in the morning at 6 a.m. Um, when the sun is up then it will uh, get the, the lights will turn off and we'll get out you see ta -da! and the light is going on everything is fine everything is illuminated and if I put time to dawn you see at 6.30 a.m. the lights are going out and yes you no need any time or you don't need any light then so one moment 6.22 and 6.30 the lights will go out Zack. so how this is done I show you in my computer um, in, t in Minecraft everything is based on ticks, so you know from the industrial craft um, all those um, e e as a EU per tick from these um, um, solar panels and those stuff. Um, 1000 ticks, you see here 1000 ticks um, are one hour in Minecraft. So you, if you want to have the time uh, 8 o'clock a.m. Um, you got 8,000 ticks on server. If you want to get um, 4 p.m. you got 16,000 ticks. If you want to have 10 p.m. you got 20,000 ticks. So your programming is all based on ticks and I show you um, the programs. First the startup. Startup runs um, just a program called test um, and if we open test you see those uh, program it's really really simple so if you you do shell run time this is just to get um, to show the the time on the computer this is the um, this is the command you need um, to save um, to to save the the tick the the amounts of tick of ticks into this variable um, into x so um, x um, yes you, you you save the tick amount into x okay x slash os pulled time um, after that I uh, do print x so I show um, and I write x on the monitor that you can see this x so um, now you're gonna do a if construct um, and we want to have um, six as we want to have the lights to go on at 6 am 30 am uh, sorry sorry 6 uh, 30 p.m. so we do um, if X is greater than 18,500 ticks then um, redstone set output bottom true so we got a redstone cable red alloy cable sorry um, on the bottom of the computer output to all these lamps um, else if X smaller than 6500 so it's if it's um, perhaps 2 a.m. or 3, 4, 5, 6 a.m. or 6, 20 a.m. then the lights should be still on so um, 6500 ticks are 6.30 a.m. Um, if X is smaller than 6.30 a.m. redstone set output bottom is also true and else if we are between 6500 ticks and 18,500 ticks um, the redstone set output um, should be false. I see here this is a failure but it works also but the bottom should be false um, the output. 
after that we sleep for two seconds and we reboot our program and reboot our PC so that um, the PC could get uh, the actual time and do the if construct. And the computer, um, we don't want it get too much stress on the server so we do this about every two seconds or every five seconds it's not that necessary um, that you need to, uh, need to have um, exactly at 6 um, 30 p.m. The, the lights to go on so um, you can take just let it sleep for five seconds or ten seconds the main thing is that if it gets, gets, gets dark the lights will turn on so OS reboot reboots the PC and then it goes back from um, the OS time and so on. So I hope you get it. If you got questions, just ask me. Um, yes, just just ask me. I will answer you. Um, so, zack, you do the new time. Yes, zero a.m. The lights go on. Um, I hope this tutorial was a... yes, I'm German, so I'm not that good in English, but I hope it was understandable. So, um, yes, write comments um, if you got questions. Okay, thank you, um, your Dr. Temples. See you.